Hi, everyone. I'm Dr. Andrea Pearson. I'm a professor at American University in Washington, DC. I'm here to introduce to you my course called Visual Identities, which is part of AU's Complex Problems Seminar Series. The Complex Problems Seminars are developed around faculty research interests. Um, and so each faculty member participating in the seminars teaches a course that they've developed uh, around issues that uh, have interested them in their scholarly life, uh, often uh, over many years. My course, Visual Identities, uh, comes from my interest in images. I'm an art historian and I specialize um, in Northern European Renaissance art. In this course, though, we're going to look at many, many different types of um, geographies and um, uh, different eras in order to understand works of art in their historical context. Uh, the theme of identity is what binds it all together uh, in the semester that we'll spend uh, with each other. I have some slides to show you, which I hope will help whet your appetite uh, for the course. And as I pull them up on the screen and we cycle through them, uh, I think uh, you'll start to see that uh, they represent a range of uh, different um, cultures and, and different eras, and uh, that they uh, also often represent the human form. Uh, the human body is one of the um, most powerful ways in which artists convey notions of identity. Uh, and we'll talk about um, uh, ways that artists have approached the human form in order to do that around issues like uh, gender, class, um, uh, race, and politics, religion. Uh, these are a few of the major categories uh, that we'll study. Uh, in a course like this, we won't have time to touch on every uh, culture that we might. Uh, so course projects will allow students to investigate a particular uh, type of work, uh, even something by a particular artist uh, that interests you. Uh, so, uh, as you'll see from the slides then, uh, we will have a big um, selection, a big variety of work, uh, many of which come from the DC museums, DC area museums, um, and some of them from other places as well. Uh, so many of these works are local. Uh, the image of the woman with the paintbrush in her hand we saw a minute ago is from the National Gallery, and uh, the one that we just looked at with the reclining uh, female figure um, is from the Smithsonian American Art Museum. Uh, so we're going to uh, have a great opportunity to collaborate together. You don't have to have a background in art or in history uh, to come into the classroom and uh, work together to build knowledge. Uh, and I really do think of my classroom in whatever form it takes, whether it's in person or virtual, uh, I think of the classroom as a place where we collaborate to form new knowledge. Uh, so uh, it's a, it will be an interesting and exciting semester. Uh, you'll build visual skills, you'll uh, build verbal skills through presentations and discussions, and also uh, written skills through a writing project. So I hope that um, you've seen something that uh, interests you as the slides have gone by, and I'll look forward to seeing you in class later on.